big news coming out earlier today that Arsenal have reached a full agreement with Ajax for defender Julian Timber. We all knew this was going to happen and it was reasonably quick actually, a couple of weeks after that our first interest was shown. Went on for a little bit this saga with a little bit of negotiations including add-ons but the full agreement has finally been reached. So where did this news come from? I think we all know where David Ornstein as per usual, been absolutely spot on throughout the whole transfer window so fair play to him. And he said that Arsenal have now reached a full agreement with Ajax to send Julian Timber. Negotiations have been completed on a fee of 40 million euros plus 5 million euros in largely realistic bonuses. The 22 year old defender has been granted permission to undergo an Arsenal medical and finalise his personal terms. Fabrizio Romano commenting on the deal and saying that after Jack and Rice Arsenal have completed the Julian Timber deal as expected, the deal was never in doubt. There was a direct call today to agree a 40 million euro deal plus 5 million euros in easy add-ons. Julian Timber was signed until June 2028 and he only wanted Arsenal super excited about the project and here we go. So I think we all knew that Julian Timber was going to sign eventually, I mean Bayern Munich were interested earlier on but he only ever wanted Arsenal, he made that very clear. Mikel Arteta has done very well with the convincing so far and done very well here, he's clearly showed him his role in the team, his minutes and everything to convince him and the deal is done so unless something horribly goes wrong with the medical which hopefully not, we really really hope it doesn't, then Arsenal will be able to sign Julian Timber. I mean I've talked about this guy, I mean I really 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 like him but at the start of the window I didn't actually think Arsenal were interested and when the news first broke that Arsenal were looking to sign Julian Timber I was very excited because I think this guy is absolutely perfect for what Mikel Arteta is trying to do with this system. Good defender, reasonable strong but he is absolutely phenomenal on the ball I mean I really can't stress this enough I obviously don't watch Ajax week in week out but you can walk from bits you see you can clearly tell he is super comfortable on the ball whether it's centre back or even that playing full back I'm sure the versatility is another reason why Arteta wants him I mean as I said centre back right back and could even do a job in the defensive midfield if there's an emergency still young as well 22 years old had experience in the Champions League as well so I really think this is the perfect Arsenal signing and the price we've gotten for I mean I believe that's about 38 million or 30 odd million something like that in fact I'll get into that in a second the actual price so good cheap deal as well we've not paid silly money to get Julian Timber and I'm super glad Arsenal have negotiated this well we all saw how much the depth issue cost us last season because when Saliba was injured we had to play holding and then obviously we didn't play as well conceding lots of goals but now Timber helps with that because if White gets an injury or needs a rest you have Timber there even if Saliba you have Timber there Timber and Tommy Astor are going to be super useful I feel so I can't stress enough I think this signing is absolutely crucial and yes it may not be the biggest of names because you look at the Kai Havertz and Declan Rice which is what most people are focusing on but I think this signing could be just as crucial and I'm absolutely buzzing with this signing I think Arsenal have done fantastic business so far in this window and I really do think they continue to do it with Julian Timber I mean yes anything can happen he could even flop but I really doubt it I think he's absolutely phenomenal only 22 as well so can clearly improve as he's still very young. I think he actually won Ajax's player of the season last season. Obviously some people think he didn't have a great year this year but last season he was phenomenal so hopefully um, under Arsenal and Mikel Arteta he can you know rediscover that brilliant form and again I'm really glad Arsenal have got this done and I'm really looking forward to seeing him in the team. So Julian Timber to Arsenal is a done deal and it is a here we go. A bit more confirmation from Mike Verwell which translates to this. After verbal agreement the paperwork of timber transfer is now finally in order the defender will quickly leave for london for his medical political also confirming that the deal is done by saying that the last terms of conditions between both clubs have been clarified last night now there's a total agreement confirmed timber will in fact join arsenal the same transfer fee is mentioned but the medical should take place as soon as possible probably on friday but it hasn't been booked green light has been given by ajax and the first to call it was obviously david ornstein simon collins was talking about the fee and he said that the fee is set to be 34.2 million plus 4.3 million in add-ons. So Mike Verwell basically confirming that the deal is done. He's been very good on this deal, tier one when it comes to Ajax new 
news. Plenty Gold also confirming that the deal is done and he's saying that the medical should probably be on Friday. However, it's not booked yet, but it will be as soon as possible. So Arsenal obviously got two medicals to do with Dick and Rice incoming and Algerian Timber on his way too. And I just love how prepared Arsenal are. They've got three of their main signings in before preseason has even begun. They obviously want to get them used to the system and not panic last minute. And I really enjoyed this, you know, preparation from Arsenal. And I think it's what top clubs do. We're just super well run now. Even in the women's team, men's team, academy, we're just such a well run club now. And there is very little to complain about at the moment. The guaranteed fee apparently is 34 million. I mean, that is an absolute steal in my opinion. For somebody with the international experience that he currently has and the Champions League experience he has at such a young age, versatile as well, is phenomenal. Ajax apparently wanted 50 million to start off with, but the way we've negotiated seems very, very well done as we are look like paying 34 million with 4 million in add-ons. Our defence is absolutely set at the moment. When you look through the years, you see poor players who shouldn't be at the club, but now you see people like Tierney, Zinchenko, White, Gabriel, Saliba, Tommy Asu, Timber, I might even be missing a few. And none of them cost a silly amount of money as well. It's just phenomenal business from Arsenal and brilliant scouting and brilliant negotiations. Just very, very well done. I would imagine some incomings would be a little bit slow now as that's our main three targets done and dusted. Not to say that we're not done this window. However, I would imagine the club would focus on the outgoings now. But just so glad that we have got the Dick and Rice and Julian Timber deal done and well done to the club for being so prepared and negotiating down to a right good fee. So obviously the official announcement I imagine would be around next week with Dick and Rice or maybe a day or two after Dick and Rice. Obviously still needs to do his medical but unless anything goes wrong, the Julian Timber will be an Arsenal player. Again, couldn't be happier. I think he absolutely suits the system right down to the ground. So welcome to Arsenal's Julian Timber. But that's it for this video guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you let me know all your thoughts in the comment section below. How happy are you that Arsenal seems super prepared getting lots of signings in right before preseason has even commenced what do you think of Julian Timber as the actual player himself what do you think he'll bring to the team what do you think are some of his you know positives but maybe some negatives how do you think he would fit into the system and what do you make about the fee do you think Arsenal have done very well to get this fee right down to around 30 to 40 million again for me I'm super happy with the deal I'm really glad Arsenal have pursued this and finally got their man I think he covers lots of positions I think he's still young and he fits in with what we're trying to do right into the system as well but that's it for this video guys thank you guys so much for watching again let me know all your thoughts in the comment section below make sure you smash that like button subscribe to the channel make sure you have the bell notification on and i'll see you in the next video